Hello everyone, this is Rico, the MTB Trail Sherpa, and today we are at the Underdown. We have never ridden here before. Tina and I are both at the end of a long week of vacation and we're pretty tired. Uh, but we've never been to this trail, so it was kind of on our way home today. And we thought, let's stop and check out a small portion of it. We're probably not going to ride a lot. We're going to check out the trail, get a feel for it, and see. Uh, it looks like it's going to be worth coming back. But we got a little bit of riding to do first, and then we'll do some summary. So here's the trailhead. It's a gravel road to get to. It's uh, a nice big parking lot area. Looks like it's well maintained. They have an under, under down trailhead up here. And over here they have a nice big sign with some history. It tells you a little bit about the history of the place. And uh, dang, the trails themselves look like they're long sections. Some nice long loops, a lot of different things to try. And uh, let's go give it a shot. Oh, and did I mention there's a storm moving in? So <laughs> hopefully we have about 45 minutes. We can get in uh, four to five miles, four or five miles. Without getting wet, but uh, hey, if we get wet, what do you think, Tina? Oh, well. She says, oh, well. Come join us. We only did a small portion. We did the blue. You got all of this up here, black. Oh. And, uh, yeah, and then uh, Prairie Dells, that's a green loop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. Oh, caught a climb right off the bat. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, all right. How you doing back there? We're going up right away. Oh no. Starting to rain a little harder. It's kind of cool. Oh, that was some good climbing to begin with. More climbing. Looks like some old, uh, old style single track. I like it. Then there's more climbing. Huh. Meet you at the top. It is raining out, but I can hear it raining, but the trees and leaves are stopping everything. So I think where we started, we got to go up. We'll get to the far end of the loop. Should be a lot of downhill. A little bit of down, nice berms. Some nice trail work going on here. Love the bench cutting. Oh yeah, a couple nice jumps there. Phew! Someone's obviously been mowing them and uh, weed whacking back. Getting the branches out of the face. Good job trail builders. So this trail split. It said right is nice, left is too. We went to the right. More climbing. I've got switchbacks at least. This is nice. Oh. You do a lot of climbing, but the uh, downs have some nice fun to them. Oh, a little swamp area down here all dried out, it looks like. It's pretty rugged back here. Oh, ferns, look at the ferns. Yeah, 
in and out of the trees, different textures. Man, they put some work into keeping these trails clear. I'm getting tired. The week is catching up to me. Oh, nice drop. Keep going up the hill, I'll meet you top. So scenic back here. Okay, we're on the return. We've made the, the corner on the loop. Heading back on the return trail to the car. All right, we're back in the woods. So we rode the disconnector trail to the far end. This is called the connector trail. So far it's been pretty kind to us as far as climbing goes. It's been some nice long open trails, some nice downhills here, but I'm sure we'll get back into some climbing. But hey, that's part of the game. Woo. This vacation exhausted me. Oh. oh, this feels nice being able to roll. It's a nice flow. Wow, this would have been the way to start the trail. Okay, so we're here. We got to get down to here. Tooling along nicely. How you doing? Huh? How you doing? Good. That was a nice. That was a nice flowy section. Yeah. In the right track? Yep. And the rain starts. Looks like we're down to uh, lake level. I'm sure that'll mean there's more climbing to do. Rico's running a naturally aspirated motor. Tina's running turbo on her e-bike. <laughs> <sighs> and she deserves it. All right, let's hope this is another long downhill. Oh yeah, this was good. Nice. The uphills are well built. They're uh, they got switchbacks. They've got level adjustments. I'm good with that. So the climbs, even though they're you're gaining a lot of elevation, they're not straight up the hill. Oh, oh yes. Woo! Like in that part. So while you can hear it raining, we're fairly dry here under the canopy. And the rain is just intermittent. So the trails are actually staying pretty good. Oh, look at this. We're coming out on a point of land. Falls away on either side. Oh, they picked some scenic routes to put in here. I bet this is really gorgeous in the fall. Oh, we're on a ridge line here. Got a little bench to enjoy the scenery. Or rest from your heart attack from all the climbing. <laughs> Take your pick. Oh, that was a big one. Woo! Oh, oh, 
didn't mean to oh, you went down it? Yeah, it was right around. Oh. I did not take. <laughs> mistakes have happened. Oh, mistakes were made. <sighs> that was epic. <laughs> oh, and then you rode down it. Yep. I good thing it was rollable. Yep. Very good. <sighs> they saved some of the good stuff for the end. <laughs> Yeah. <sighs> the drop here. <sighs> nice. Land. Land. Oh, back up once more. Whoa, tough one. <sighs> oh, dear. Oh, there's the car. <sighs> All right, so we finished a small loop out here, probably just under five miles, 700 feet of climb. Whew. I'm pretty dead. So we did, we started with the disconnector all the way up, came back on the connector. It's a lot of climbing out here. Whew. I was tired when I started, I'm still tired. Now we got four hours to drive home and our vacation is over. We have Sunday off, back to work Monday. So Tina, what's your assessment of these trails? Uh, not Tina approved on the first half. Tina approved on the second half of this trail. And definitely not approved at any time after a week vacation. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't come tired. Make sure you're rested when you come hit these trails. Yes. Then you enjoy them more. All right. So, but we know what these trails are like now. I've always heard of the Underdown. Today we got to check it out. Well-built trails. Trail trail builders, uh, thank you for all your efforts. Some really nice stuff out there. Downhills, you got some trail candy. Very scenic throughout the ride. I like how it's interwined around the uh, the hills, moraines. Um, well done. I would recommend coming out. We'll have to come out and check out some more of the trail. Again, we're at the uh, Underdown uh, bike, Mountain Bike Park. It's in Hinneman Hills and it's north of Wausau, Wisconsin. Okay, so these trails are maintained by Central Wisconsin Off-Road Cycling Coalition. You guys and gals are doing a great job.